The homecoming football game is still weeks away for the Wasika Blue Jays. But the head coach got his own warm welcome when he came home from the hospital today after collapsing on the field during Friday's game. Fox 9's Courtney Godfrey has more. When the Wasika varsity football team took the field Friday night, they never imagined the game would end shoulder to shoulder with their opponent, kneeling in prayer. Their coach collapsing on the sidelines in cardiac arrest. It's a lot to uh, to take to know that you scared that many people that are so important in my life. Today, many of those same people giving Brad Wendland the warm homecoming he deserves as he's forced to slow down and let a new medical device implanted in his chest heal. They put what's called an ICD into my chest, which is like having an AED in my chest at all times. As he writes thank you notes to the many people who stepped up in the last several days, he says the biggest thank yous are owed to the three people who were able to restart his heart, athletic trainers from both teams and a nurse who ran down from the stands. I know they'll say that uh, they were just doing their job, but you know their leadership and their take charge ability and their decisiveness you know, made the difference. It, it's the reason I'm here. And while he says he's going to take a short break from coaching, he knows he won't be able to stay away very long. I'm going to tell the kids, don't treat me any different, you know. Don't, uh, don't take it easy on coach. I'm the same guy I was last week. Um, I just got more hardware in my chest right now. As he plans to be here for years to come. When I'm ready, uh, when I feel up to it, um, you know, I want to show back the love that they've shown to me. Courtney Godfrey, Fox 9. And the coach hopes his story emphasizes the importance of CPR training and on-field AEDs for sports programs everywhere. Yeah, a lot of valuable lessons That's in all of that. Great example just of what can happen if the right equipment and people are around. Yeah, I'm just so glad he's doing well.